Hi everyone, welcome to researchmd.com. Uh, thank you so much for joining. My name is Premier Charyat. I'm a program director, internal medicine residency, transitional residency, and I teach medical student residents on a regular basis. I'm also director of research, assistant um, professor of medicine, two large medical school. So we're going to be um, doing a series of lectures on hematology. So we're going to start with the basic today. That's the whole purpose. We're going to look at, you know, we're going to go back to where it all begins. Where does it begin? Bone marrow. Okay, so when you look at the bone marrow, you have the multi multi-quadrant stem cell, and you got two lineage here: myeloid stem cell, and what is the other one? Lymphoid stem cell. Okay, so we're going to look on the right side. What happened? You got the myeloid stem cell. You got all this erythropoiesis, thrombopoiesis, granulocytopoiesis, and monocytopoiesis happens. Okay, when you look at on this side, what we have is you got the lymphoid stem cell, lymphopoiesis, then you got the lymphoblasts pretty much, and then you got this B cell, T cell, and natural killer cell, plasma cell, T helpers, and T cytotoxic cell develop. Okay, so everybody got that? So just uh, start with the bone marrow. You got two types. Um, I mean, start from the multipotent stem cell, you got myeloid stem cells and the lymphoid stem cell. So let's look at what happened in erythropoiesis. What is the stimulant for erythropoiesis? Somebody tell me. Erythropoietin. Erythropoietin. Where does erythropoietin produce? Kidneys. Kidney. Okay. So erythropoietin, you got erythropoiesis, pro-erythroblast, erythroblast, reticulocyte count, and erythrocyte. Can somebody tell me, like, what is the life uh, lifespan of reticulocyte? How many days is going to be in the blood? 43 days. Okay, what happened to erythrocyte, RBC, how many, what is the lifespan? 120 days. 120 days. So remember, it's good to remember the reticulocyte count, you know, three days, and this is 120 days, okay? And then you got thrombopoiesis, where the platelet happens. You got megakaryocyte progenitor cell. You got the immature megakaryocyte, and then you got uh, mature megakaryocyte, and then you got the formation of platelets. Okay, and then let's look at the granulocytopoiesis where the granular cells are made. Which one is granular? Eosinophils, basophils, and uh, neutrophils, right? So when you talk, when you talk about, um, so when you talk about the granulocytopoiesis, you got myeloblast. It is turned into eosinophils, which is bilobed, is easily recognizable. Then you also have basophils. And then from the promyelocyte, you got myelocyte, metamyelocyte, band cell, uh, segmented neutrophil. So you'll see this in an infection band cell a lot too. That's where the love shift, we can kind of say that. Okay, it's good to know all of this kind of link too. So when you talk about monocytopoiesis, you got monocytes, then you kind of turn into a macrophage over here. Okay, remember all those um, erythropoiesis, thrombopoiesis, granulocytopoiesis, or monocytopoiesis. Now we know erythropoiesis, um, erythropoietin is stimulant in the kidney. What about the one thrombopoiesis? Where's the stimulant over there? Thrombopoietin, right? Where's that produced? Liver. Liver, very good, excellent. So that's good to know. And then we come to this side. On the left side, you got the lymphoid stem cell, and then you got lymphopoiesis, right? And the lymphopoiesis turn into lymphoblast, and then you got B cell, T cell, and then natural killer cells. And then we have plasma cell, which is um, from the B cell, the plasma cells comes into. Okay, and then the T cell, um, you have like T helper cell, T cytotoxic cells, and uh, that's where on this side from the lymphoid stem cell. Okay. Anybody have any questions? Okay. What is the lifespan of platelets, Dr. Chiria? Okay, that's good to know. What is the lifespan? The lifespan of platelets is almost like seven to ten days. Okay, it's good to know, like some of the uh, lifespan. And then when you talk about, you know, if the RBC is 120 days, and we know the particular site count is what? Somebody tell me Three again. Days. Three days. And the platelets, what is it again? Seven to ten days. Seven to ten. Say ten days for okay. platelets. Okay. And uh, thank you so much for watching. We'll be back with another presentation. Please subscribe to our channel.